Hello and thanks for tuning into my channel. This video is going to be about the Korinsky 77 challenge lock, the sergeant. It's been over at Bosnian Bills and uh, he sent it back to Korinsky. He did some uh, modifications to it and passed it along to me. I picked this one one time off cam now. Uh, actually forgot to turn on the video camera. Um, pretty pissed about that, but that's the way it is. Um, it gave a ridiculously, ridiculously, ridiculous. That's ridiculous. A large full set. Um, yeah, well, I'm just gonna try to do it again. Um, so wish me luck. This is quite a battle. Okay, we got pretty good full set now. 90 degrees would be about there. So the normal lock should have popped long ago. Now it's about hopeless to feel which pin is missing. Because none of them give feedback I might just turn the plug a little bit back just to see if that loosens up some of the binders and it might be number six a little gamble but let's gamble on number six gonna help it a little bit a little bit more I think I set him dropped a few pins lost the false set I just overset the sixth. set back come on you devil Yes! There we go. There we go. Ah. 
Lovely. Okay, let's get some tools and got it. Just gonna stick something in there not to lose it. <laughs> Sorry. This will work. Okay, let's see all threaded chambers. frame screw and another screw I guess that's it all threaded upper chambers and of course all the springs are in there, I can take a look at those as well. 
He used different types of springs, and there's a, another screw. I don't know where that came from, but I'll figure it out. We have to do a little close up because this is one evil lock. Okay, we got custom pin, some sort of, I don't know what they're called, but they're all custom bottom pin, key pins, and there's, it was two screws, one as a driver, uh, a couple of, you know, one screw is in the sixth and a five, that's also a screw. Uh, that's a regular T pin. Yeah, ev pure evil. Pure evil. And thanks for watching. Thank you, Kurinsky.